unless we find all TB, we cannot stop the spread of TB. And then, finding all TB is not enough. Finding all TB early enough, and mark the words, early enough, is critically important if we are to end TB. If we can find TB early enough, when it is asymptomatic and link each of the persons to proper effective TB treatment and support them through the treatment and care, we can help shift the gears from TB control mode to TB elimination mode. <coughs> Finding all TB early and accurately needs the program to be rooted in elimination mode. And we have the need to change TB control program to TB <coughs> elimination program. WHO gave the find, treat, all call in 2018 for governments to replace the underperforming microscopy test with those with, uh, uh, with uh, <coughs> sorry, with 100% upfront molecular testing by 2027. Yet, in the year 2023, less than 50% of those with TB who could get diagnosed were diagnosed on microscopy globally. Microscopy, as we all know, misses half or more of TB. So we miss the other half of people who had TB and they took a TB test. We miss them because we used a bad test. Most importantly, we have WHO recommended only point of care, battery operated, lab independent molecular test, true nat. And I'm sure Samantha will talk of her experience about the use of that. That also runs on solar energy. And we have ultra portable handheld x-rays backed with computer-aided diagnosis, which can help screen asymptomatic people with TB early on. Why are we not deploying these tests on scale? Till we get a safe and effective TB vaccine and roll it out quickly with equity and justice once it is there. Let us at least roll out the best of the currently existing TB tools that are available for diagnostics, treatments, and TB prevention. We have to do all what science and evidence shows works to prevent TB and stop the spread of infection. Keeping this in mind, over a year ago, many individuals and organizations came together to launch the global call to find all TB and also to stop the spread of infection and reduce human suffering. TB People India, Asia Pacific Cities Alliance for Health and Development were among those organizations that led the process with support from Malvayu. Thanks 